sometimes you need to analyze a lot of data sets that, ca that have key hierarchy to them. For example, in this case, I have paired end Illumina data. So every sample, for example, sample A here, there are forward read files and there are reverse read files. But I have a lot of them, so I obviously don't want to deal with each and every one of them. So I want to bundle them in the collection. But when I do this, this collection needs to reflect the fact that they're paired. So let's build such a collection. So we will select all data sets and for all selected, build list of data set pairs. This will open this wizard and the wizard is empty. So what we need to do here is give Galaxy a clue how the forward and reverse read files are named. And you can see that forward reads have underscore F and the reverse reads have underscore R. So let's type underscore F and hit enter. And let's type underscore R and hit enter. And you can see forward reads, reverse reads, and we can pair them by clicking on that button or we can we can just click all to pair. So this is how my collection will look like. So I have sample A, it has two files, forward and reverse, sample B, and so on. Um, so let's um, again hide original elements and I will call collection my reads and click create list. You can see that it generated the collection. If we click on it, you will see that there are six samples. But if we click on each sample, it has forward and reverse reads inside of it. So how do I use this collection with tools? Let's map these reads uh, against human genome with uh, BWEMM again. Now here, I'm going to select paired collection. And you can see that this becomes visible. So BWA will know that in fact it needs to run six jobs and each of these jobs includes uh, forward and reverse reads.